My name is Alex Ischeub, I'm part of the management of Team Katusha and I am actually also responsible for the, what we call the Katusha project. The usual uh, business model for a cycling team is actually uh, either to have one big owner putting a lot of money in the team or to have one or two major sponsors that finance actually the, the entire team. Uh, basically we have realized and uh, I think everybody knows it at the moment that this business model doesn't work. Uh, you have probably noticed that a lot of teams uh, are dying or changing names every two or three years uh, and it's difficult for the public also to uh, follow a team for years as you can have in other sports uh, and so we have decided to try to change a bit our own business model uh, by creating other sources of revenue. At the moment we have let's say three major businesses we are developing the first one being a clothing or an apparel company. In addition to this uh, clothing business, we have a, a travel company that uh, has been created this year in, 2000, uh, in 2017. And again, the idea is to use the team, uh, use the experience we have with the race, but also with uh, training, uh, competing as well, giving advice to people, and most importantly, to bring some people to the race, to bring some people to uh, to the team. And the cafe is actually the link between all of it. Because before ride, after the ride, what everybody likes from professional to amateurs is just to go in a cafe and a nice patisserie and a nice flat white or a cappuccino. And we want people, cyclists or not, to come into a cafe uh, and enjoy their time uh, after or, or before ride. The business model is uh, actually quite simple. First of all, a team needs additional source of revenue in order for the teams to make sure it's, uh, it will have a long life, if I can say it like this. So we do not only want to rely on one or two big sponsors, uh, we prefer first to have several sponsors uh, and also to have uh, our own source of revenue, apparel company, travel, cafes. Uh, and at the end of the day, when we bring a sponsor on board, we want the sponsor to also bring us a little bit more than just money. Could be activation, could be publicity, could be uh, visibility. And on the contrary, we are giving a little bit more than a cycling team to the sponsor because we have some cafe, we have some clothing, we have our own publicity, we have the travel. So uh, it's what we call the 360 degree model. In our best dream, if I, if I can say it like this, we would like to have a team that is truly international. It means like whether you are from Australia, from Switzerland, from the US or from Russia, you just really identified to what the team is doing, to the activity we are doing. Uh, and I would like this team to stay for a very long period of time. I would like, as we have for football, for instance, to have a team that is a family team. So you have the grandfather that teach uh, the kids and the grandkids that's the best team for the family. And you can have during 20 years, 30 years, uh, a, team, a team which is staying. Uh, that, that will be probably very good for, for cycling. Yeah.